well, I'm here guys, and so far, so good. Not really seeing anyone around. Downside is they've recently put sheep in the field, so it's a bit, let's put it this way, I didn't really fancy sleeping with my head next to a sheep turd, so I had to be quite selective. Uh, but I've done all right. I'll show you around. I'm sorry if it's a bit windy, but I'm on top of the bank, so bear with me. You can see the roof of the lookout shelter there, where I would dearly love to camp, but it's all been secured. So that's off the, off the table. But from where I'm camped, this is my view. I'll show you home. Right, here's home for the night. I've got the old cheapy chair out for its maiden voyage. I'll just show you over the top of the bank behind of where I am. There's the beach. I was tempted, but bloody hell it's cold and windy for a bit of beach. So that'll be later in the later in the year slightly. There's the rest of the bunker. I'm on the roof of the ammo store because it's the only flat bit of ground. This is the bedroom. It'll be the first sort of proper test for the, the Miltech bivvy. And uh, yeah, be interesting to see. Be interesting. Just made a simple little shelter in here. Bit annoyed about having to have the pole in the middle. That always winds me up because invariably I knock it over. But uh, Hmm, it's not a problem I get when I'm in the woods. Plenty of stuff to tie it to, but never mind. If I wanted to camp here, it's what I had to do. Two pole system, one guy line, should do the job. That's enough for me. Time for a coffee.
Hi folks. Yes, I know what you're thinking. This does not look like my wild camp location. Now, it wasn't a disaster. I had no farmer chase me with a shotgun. I didn't set the tarp alight. I got bored, which is a bit weird. I've never ever failed on a wild camp and bailed out, but I did on this one. I think it was the location. I'm definitely a woodland person. Camping out in the open, as much as the views are lovely, there's not much else to do once I was all set up. If there'd been someone with me to chat to, maybe that would have been different. If I'm in the woods and I'm on my own, there's always stuff to do. Ponsing about around camp and processing firewood, keeping the fire going. But I just got bored. So when I looked at my watch and it was about five o'clock and I thought to myself, I've already made a drink, I've already read some of my book and I've got another 12 hours to go. I just wasn't feeling it. So I packed my stuff and I come home. Is it a complete fail? As far as the, this camp's concerned, yes. In total for me, no. It has just reinforced the fact I belong in the woods. So, strange engine, strange ending to this one. We'll do better next time. I won't be camping in a field. That's for certain. Sorry to disappoint. Never mind. I'll see you soon.